Hey everybody, I'm Rob Vogt with Vote Auction here with our fine arts specialist, Natalie Curran. Hi there, we're having a fantastic Texas and Western art auction next Saturday, June 17th, with an emphasis on early Texas art, and we'd love to walk you through four examples. So let's start with this beautiful Rolla Taylor painting here. Um, Rolla Taylor came to San Antonio, Texas in 1889, where he studied with both of the Onderdonks and Jose Arpa, whose impressionistic style we can really see here in this example, which we think was painted somewhere just west of San Antonio. And like Rolla Taylor, Peter Honstad, another early Texas artist, came to San Antonio in the 1920s, 1929 in fact, like so many other artists did for a big competition with a big cash prize, the Edgar B. Davis competition. And in fact, Peter Honstadt won two awards in that competition and ended up settling in comfort or outside of comfort in a beautiful isolated farmhouse and then began started painting all this sort of rolling uh, hills and landscapes around him. And uh, we have this example from the San Antonio State, uh, one of several that we have in this auction. Like Peter Honstadt, Harry Anthony DeYoung came to San Antonio in 1928 for the previous year's Edgar B. Davis competitions. Um, and this lovely example we have here from a San Antonio estate was painted out in West Texas, um, at Olympia Canyon in fact, and you can see these uh, cattle herders coming through the cottonwoods here, uh, where DeYoung was teaching a summer painting camp just near uh, Fort Davis. And perhaps the earliest Texas artist of all, Carl Hermann Lunkwitz. Uh, this is a German-born immigrant to America, but was classically trained at some of the biggest academies, best academies in Europe, and then came to the area near Fredericksburg. And you see in this piece here, of course, this is the area around Fredericksburg, around Enchanted Rock and Pernalis. So he would travel around all those areas, but we're talking about way back in the mid 19th century, like 1850, 1860 time period. And so, what makes him so truly important as an artist in Texas history is that he was the first true skilled pictorial artist to come and paint this land. And so this piece, it's a rare example. It's actually from the area around Fredericksburg and we're really excited to have this one in this auction. Well, in addition to early Texas art, we've also got a fantastic array of Texas modernists, Native American art, bronzes, sculpture, San Antonio crafts, something for everyone. Truly, about 322 pieces in all, and all of it can be seen on our website. So please join us and celebrate Texas art with us and the story of Texas, after all. That'll be Saturday, June 17th. We'll start at 1 o'clock. You can go and see everything in this auction right now and even bid at TexasAuction.com.